In today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Epson Rapid Receipt RR70W wireless scanner with the Android phone. So we will connect this phone with the Wi-Fi network of our home and then we will start using it for wireless scanning. Now the first step is to go to your Android phone and download the Epson Document Scan app. You can download it from the App Store. That's the app and the name is written on the top, Epson Document Scan. Next step is to add your scanner. So click on the scan icon here. Select scanner. On the next page, click on the setup. Scroll down and look for RR70W. That is here. There are two ways to use this scanner using the Wi-Fi and using the Wi-Fi Direct. So direct Wi-Fi means using the scanner Wi-Fi and Wi-Fi infrastructure means using your home router. So I'm going to use the Wi-Fi infrastructure. There are two methods, WPS push button and manually. So let's do the manual. Click next. Next step is to move the wireless button to the right hand side to enable it. And next is to move the power button to the right hand side and release it. Wait for the white light to be stable. So it's flashing right now. It's ready. Click next. Search for scanners. RR70W. It will display the network name. So you just have to enter the Wi-Fi password. Once you enter the password, press OK. Scanner will restart. So click Next. And on the scanner you will see the wireless light is flashing. Once it becomes stable, that means our scanner is connected to the Wi-Fi network. Again you will see your scanner on the main screen so select it scanner setup is complete press ok and we are ready to use this scanner for example I'm just going to do a quick scan you can scan anything you want for example I'm just going to scan this photo card so I place it here click on the scan icon on the next page we can select the document size and if you are not sure about the size, click on the auto and then click on the scan icon. Here we can see it has scanned it correctly. So that's the scanning result. Click on the done and then click on the save. So that's here, it should be showing up. Here we can see our saved item. Now go back to the main screen. And this way we can do the Wi-Fi setup of this scanner and start using it for wireless scanning using an Android phone and your home Wi-Fi network. Thanks for watching.